This is the General Dynamics Land System Robotics Division, MUTT, M -U -T -T, the Multi-Utility Tactical Transport. It's designed to lighten the load of the, uh, the soldier, the marine, and the sailor. It will carry 600 pounds and will tow an additional 1,200 pounds. And of course, anything involving the military, they've got a weaponized version. We've got the M250 caliber with a Trap T360. And of course, the Trap T360 can do the M2, can do the M134 minigun. It can do the EPG. It can do the M240, M249. The MUTS operated one of three ways. It can be remotely operated with the General Dynamics controller, hand controller. Very simple, you know, forward, back. Another mode of operation is the tether mode. This is, you gotta pull that up. Grab the tether, walk out about two meters. You'll feel it, in, you'll hear it engage and it just moves along. So any, anywhere you go, you stop, it'll stop. You go forward. Yeah. But, and there's safety systems right now. The bumper's engaged, so you hit anything and it'll, it'll shut down. Okay. And you got the, uh, the teleop mode uh, for the vehicle. This hand controller, the Mighty Hawk, actually controls both the weapon and the mutt. When you turn it on, you'll see a reticle. That means it's in the, the weapon mode. This side of the controller drives the weapon. So up, up, down, left, right. Cameras, thermal, visual. Switch over to vehicle, you just hit the mode switch. You'll see that the weapon will swing to the 12 o'clock. These cameras on the side of the sensor packet is the visual cameras that are used for forward and reverse motion of the MUT. There's different configuration and, and controls. But, and then this toggle switch controls the uh, actual MUT. So. Of course, in the weapons mode, you got the reticle. Uh, you get the arm fire. That's a, another safety system where it has, you can't just inadvertently hit one button and it fires. As soon as you arm the system, you'll see that the reticle turns red and it automatically puts the system into stabilization. So if you're moving, you've got that stab stable platform to be able to fire on the move. Um, you can switch from visual, visual to thermal. You also got a laser range finder. The laser range finder goes into the circle, engages the range, 25 meters, back over, and then you're ready to target. And then the ballistic solution is adjusted for those ranges.